left after 10 years. And I never, ever looked back at that trauma and thought that I still had things to do to deal with it. But I did. So when I was faced with this traumatic situation, I didn't have the tools in my toolbox because I never went and talked about trauma. I never looked at that trauma in the face and sat with it and learned to grow from it. So when I found myself in an abusive situation, I was triggered and I was hurt and I was scared and it took me a long time to get out of it. That's my personal struggle that honestly everybody for the last six months in politics at City Hall has told me is none of anybody else's business and to be quiet about it. But it is your business. It's your business because I'm your elected leader. And I am here to make sure that we have a platform for the issues that matter most. Yeah. And it's not necessarily a pothole. It's those relationships that bring us down that make it hard for us to get out of bed every day. And so I'm here today to share, yes, I am responsible for an inappropriate relationship that I had. I've taken that responsibility publicly. I've talked about it publicly. I've posted it on social media. And I've taken responsibility. After June 3rd, I got into an outpatient program for two weeks. I have a crisis therapist. I have a psychosomatic therapist. 